uh, a while ago, I got into Astrus, which is the open source telephony server, I guess nearly five years ago now. Um, and uh, at the time, one of the reasons that I was very interested was to do a cheap roaming uh, system whereby when I was traveling overseas, uh, calls to my mobile phone in the UK would be redirected to a SIP trunk, which would go out of a US SIP trunk and to a US cell phone. So kind of a way of doing, you know, a penny per a minute international call roaming, which is quite fun. Um, and I did that, I guess, nearly five years ago now. Um, and um, since then, the system's kind of grown. Um, as you can see, I have various uh, Cisco 7940 series IP phones in my apartment that I've bought off eBay. Um, these are similar to some that I have in, in my real office uh, environment, um, except these are all programmed with the SIP firmware for Cisco. I bought a service contract uh, cheaply to do that. Um, and um, yeah, and so I have standard features like, uh, you know, call directories here. I can go into my external directory and I can pull it down from my server, see all my friends and family, short dial numbers, um, special magic numbers for um, automatically recording meetings, um, things like that. Um, I have the messages button works. Password. Yeah, it gets my messages. The uh, the light status light here on the phone will work, um, so I can uh, um, set that up. Uh, when a message comes in, this light will go on, uh, and um, uh, various fancy dial plan settings exist. So, for example, I can dial my UK mobile number directly without using any international prefix. So, for example, I can just call that. Greetings. You have called a legacy UK mobile phone number of John Masters. Friends, family, and business associates should already have updated contact information. But if you do not, please ask me for details. Use my new number the next time you call. And so forth. This number may um, cease to operate It's going to forward future. this now. If you would like to hold, your call will be forwarded to me in a few moments. One moment, please. Okay, and I'll hang out before it forwards to the phone that I'm using to make this recording. Um, but then it will forward through to my standard system, which answers the phone and plays music on hold with a menu system greeting uh, whilst handling the caller. Um, that's kind of useful. Uh, I also have a, a regular UK number that people call, so... Greetings. Your call is being forwarded at no additional cost to you to John Masters, who is currently in the Eastern United States time zone. Note that I am not Iceland Express. Although this number is very similar, it is not the same. Okay, your call is now forwarding. And then the uh, caller gets the, uh, the same kind of treatment, comes through to my US cell phone, has various rules. They get music on hold while it uh, tries various different phones and uh, does a little dance. Um, but we can get more clever than that. Um, I recently started using the databases quite uh, extensively. So for example, Asterisk now knows the phone numbers of all of my colleagues. Um, and when they call, it will remind them uh, how to get hold of me uh, internally within the company, as well as uh, you know, other preferences that I may or may not have. Uh, and if I'm on vacation, I could set that message. Um, I don't know if I will, but I could to inform them that I'm temporarily not available. Similarly, it has the numbers for various partners and others I work with, reminding them that uh, they can call me, but also they may want to contact the official support channels, uh, which is a nice touch, I think. Um, and I have various other features. For example, uh, I can put telemarketers into a list. So if I add myself temporarily to this list uh, here, uh, and then call myself. Uh, actually, that may not work correctly because uh, I uh, I need to use the phone that I'm I'm calling. But if I if I have a telemarketer uh, who calls me, um, I can play the message that they get. Uh, telemarketers will hear uh, this message uh, here. Greetings, this is John Masters. Zippity doo da, zippity day, making telemarketers go away. That's right, this is a 
song designed to waste your day. Zippity doo da, zippity day, goodbye. So I got a little sing song I do there for telemarketers. I've also got one that's uh, just obnoxious for, for, for blacklisting purposes, so I can play the obnoxious one. I'll stop it after a moment. But uh, here you go. Hello? This is John. I'm having trouble hearing you. It must be a bit of a bad line. Can you hear me now? Hang on. I'm just trying to see if I muted the phone by mistake. You know how these things can be. Okay. Let me see if this is better. Can you hear me now? Weird. I think all I can hear is myself. Let me try something else. Hang on a moment. There. And I'll cut it off there, but the point is it's uh, seemingly a regular conversation and it goes on for a little while. So the person is designed, it's designed to make the person just sit on the line waiting to hear from me. And of course, uh, <laughs> they, never, they never will. After a while, it, uh, it informs them that this, the entire point of that was to waste their time. Um, I also have um, various others. For example, one that's coming in soon is uh, if you uh, don't uh, if you don't have caller ID, it will uh, direct you to uh, my voicemail and ask you to leave a message in certain situations. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use that yet, but that's an interesting idea. Then I would just have to call back if there wasn't any caller ID. Um, and um, um, I have some others as well. Um, let me see what else do I have here. Um, well, friends and family get a customized greeting. Um, I have a, uh, a screened one as well. I can add, I can easily add callers using the asterisk database commands to the screened number here. So I can do this. Uh, Greetings. This is John Masters. If you have legitimate business with me, please leave me a message after the tone, and I will return your call as soon as possible. Yeah, etc. Um, so there's that one there. Uh, I also have specific ones for certain companies that might call me. Um, so for example, um, let's see. Uh, I used to have a uh, Barclay card in the UK. I haven't had one for a while, but let's uh, suppose they, they, they were to call. Barclays, thank you for calling. Your number was automatically recognized as belonging to Barclays. Please leave a message after the tone, and I will return your call. If your call is sales related, please leave a message explaining that you have heard this automated greeting and have added my number to a list that you will not be calling with sales or marketing offers in the future. Thank you. So um, as you can hear, various different uh, greetings for different entities and companies that might call me. Um, as far as lines go, I have several in the UK, I have several in the US, um, I have uh, the Fedora VoIP uh, system set up. Um, they all have different uh, dial plan entries that these phones around my apartment can use, or also soft phones. Um, I have um, various forwarding options, I have music on hold, multiple lines, um, that sort of thing. Um, I also have emergency contact systems. So, for example, you can dial me and get a, uh, you know, press this number and hear about the emergency information. Um, and um, um, I also have um, various ability to do direct inward system access. So, for example, I can call myself and type in an access code and then make phone calls uh, cheaply if I need to, or make a number that I'm at appear to be my uh, my cell phone number if I need to. Um, I can call myself in the U.S. Um, whoops. Greetings. Please hold while we try to locate John Masters, or press 1 for a menu star to leave a voicemail. At this point, it's uh, it's calling all these phones, including the one that I'm currently on. Here, it's, there's a holding call here, and I've got the icon coming up. I could press one for a menu, um, and it's going to uh, to go into the main menu system here now. Main menu. To leave me a voicemail, press star or just hold. For authorized internal access, press two. In case of emergency, press four. To hear this list well, of numbers again, to myself. press one. Call forwarding. Voicemail system. You've reached my voicemail. You can also email me at jcm at johnmasters. That's so anyway, quite fun, I think.